Hello. Hi. Hey. For some reason, like when I make a noise or something, my camera just starts recording on its own. And I'm trying to figure out why, because that shit weird. I got questions. I don't I don't like that. I don't like that. It's giving very much creepy. Okay, so I'm back with another Karen reaction, and I actually have wireless headbuds, but I'm lazy as shit. Don't feel like Bluetooth and all of that, so we don't work with these. You're going to hear some very loud shit in the background because I have ghetto neighbors who do not respect me or what I do, okay? And the people going to the rodeo, as y'all seen in my other video, if you ain't watched it, go watch it, are extremely loud outside. It's cars and bikes all up and down the outside. People's walking, yelling, playing music. I got one more day. I got one more day until this shit over with. I can't, I can't wait. My nerves. My nerves. They, they this thin. The bad kids is outside. Take y'all asses back to school and fuck spring break. Spring break, the spring break is over. It's over. I'm mad. I'm frustrated. <laughs> Shit. I started this off me. Sorry, y'all. I'm upset. <laughs> and if you've seen the other video, you already know, because it's the same day. It's the same. It's the same day. Okay? It's just late at night now. Well, it ain't late. It's 9.30. I, I hate it here. I want to move so bad. The Lord going to make a way. So anyway, like I was saying, I made my own Karen compilation. Shout out to Brooklyn once again for sending me these Karen videos. Um, he sent me a couple, then I found a couple more. <clears throat> so I put them all together and made my own little compilation. YouTube probably going to age restrict the video because one of, one of the videos got the kids in it. It, I just posted the compilation on my YouTube page as private, and they restricted the shit. So I'm like, but why? It's private for one, so what difference does it make? Fuck last YouTube. But anyway, let's get into it. I need to laugh, because clearly I am just not with the shit today. Okay, make sure I'm recording. I, I am actually, you're, in fact, yes, taking the You're taking my, my property. Well, you know, there's been a lot of comings and goings of UPS trucks in this neighborhood. What about, like, what about that? A lot that? of packages coming so? to this house particularly. <laughs> Hold up. Did she say a lot of comings and goings of U UPS trucks? Ain't that what they supposed to do? I could have swore that's what they supposed, ain't that what they supposed to do? Or is, is that not their job to come and go and drop off the mail? What? Well, something's going on in there. Something's so, going on so in there. So it's no, Amazon, I'm taking the package. It's my I'm Amazon wish list. list. I'm taking the package. No, you're not taking no, my package. I am, that's no, my wish list. And I'm going to keep pausing it so y'all might as well get ready. <laughs> he says my Amazon wish list. <laughs> Baby, let me tell you, I understand your pain because if you touch my Amazon package, we gonna have an issue. What you not gonna do is touch my Amazon package. Please, please, please don't touch my Amazon package. Please don't do that. Don't do that. Not my Amazon pack. Not my Amazon package. You will not. I understand that brother's pain. That's my wish list you fucking with. Excuse me! Excuse, Excuse me! me. Oh, he oh my god! You killed me! Not he I did not you kill you. You're fine. You, oh my god! You sprayed me with whatever that stuff is. Hold up. What did she spray him with? You killed me. Why? Why Karen's always got to be dramatic? Like, like why they? Why they always got to be like overly dramatic? Like I don't understand it. 
Make it make sense. Like, why y'all doing too much? Like, y'all are doing... they Y'all do absolutely just way too much. It's, it's, it's just really extra. It's giving very much dramatic, and I'm not fucking with it. I'm not fucking with it. It's stupid. And that dog was just like, hit this bitch go again. Like, he was clearly unbothered. That was the most unbothered dog I ever seen. Like, he was just literally minding his own fucking business. He not, he not fooling with your shit. He not finna be protective and start biting the dude. He not finna do none of that because he know your shit and he's sick of it. Gonna be in jail. I really. Oh my god. Okay. Ew. This really. See, first of all, let me tell you something. Hold on. You should have known. See, y'all got to understand who to fuck with and who not to fuck with. Look at that sister. Hmm? Look at that sister. She ain't to be fucked with. In or out of uniform. For one, she's a police officer. I don't know why y'all think y'all above the law. I, I don't know why y'all think y'all above the law. I, I guess it's because the way the law is set up and justice and shit. But sometimes... You can't get away with everything, especially with a black cop, especially with a black woman cop. She was looking for a reason to beat your ass. She want all that. You don't, don't, don't do that. You fucked up. Now you really fucked up. Cause look, look at her. I wouldn't fuck with her in or out of uniform. I wouldn't fuck with her on the street as a citizen. I wouldn't fuck with her in that goddamn police uniform. You knew better. You knew better. Yeah, you did. Get her ass. Get uh, her ass. Yeah, I got no money. Jason, Jason, Jason. Jason, Jason. Ah! Ah! <laughs> she got <laughs> I don't know what was funnier. The person saying, Taser, Taser, Taser. <laughs> or her actually getting tased. Like, <laughs> with the wrong one now had it been one of us and the roles was reversed and the race the race uh, the cop was white and the person was black y'all know we would have been dead it wouldn't have been no fucking taser that would have been a bullet but that's a whole nother video in itself I'm not gonna go there but that shit was definitely fucking funny that's what you get taste her right in the ass show it again hmm? show it now show it now red and all <laughs> taser taser Karen loses it. Throws the hashtag BLM candles. I literally live here. Hold up. Did she say my pussy mouse? Ew. I really ain't got nothing for that, because if I got something for it, that's going to go into a whole nother video. Like, why the fuck? Why y'all so mad at the whole BLM thing? Like, oh, that's right, because racism exists. Like, black lives don't matter. People kill me with that bullshit. Like, so you felt the need to go into Walmart, because that obviously looked like Walmart, and throw the candles? Like, you that upset? You that mad? You could have just not went in the store. You could have just not stopped at that section. But you want to be rebellious. As if Walmart security or whoever ain't going to get you for them candles. You going to have to pay for them hoes. I'd make her donate the money to like some black organization. I'm not going to say Black Lives Matter because y'all know I don't like Black Lives Matter, the organization. If you ain't seen that video, go watch it. But I would definitely make her donate money to a black cause. Yeah. Yeah, I would. Y'all, is it Karen? I experienced my first one. Karen! Whoa, yeah, damn. Hold oh, on. It's a Karen. She blocked me from my neighborhood. Wait a minute. I have a gun. You better back up. Whoa. Karen got some ass on her. Did y'all see that? Whoa. Roll it back. Roll it back. Hold on. 
the Karen with the donk? Did Karen have some ass on her? Hold on, because I like some ass now. I don't care what race you are. Wait a minute. Y'all, is it Karen? I experienced my first one. Wait a yeah, damn yeah, minute. Karen is thick. She's walking from our neighborhood. Listen. I have a gun. You better back up. Please leave my car. She said, I got a gun, you better back up. I wouldn't even wonder. Mm -hmm. I, would, I wouldn't even wonder. I'd have just cocked that bitch. I'd, I'd have just had it. First of all, my shit, it's already on my lap. <laughs> I'm not finna play with you. My shit already out. I'd have just had that bitch sitting right there. With the phone. I'd have been like, <laughs> playing with me if you want to, bitch. I'm finna pop your ass. Get the fuck away from my car. <laughs> but I'm mad she had an ass though. Like Karen low key thick. Like damn, I'm I'm mad, but then she threw me. She threw me with the thickness. I wasn't prepared. I'm not trying to back up. up, man. Back up. You have a gun. God, damn. Yeah. You're not getting my car. What are you doing? Call who you want. See, that kills me when they actually like do that whole calling the police thing because they assume just because you black or a minority or whatever, you're not, you don't live there just because of the way you look. Like, that shit kills me. Because do y'all think y'all the only people who live in nice places? Do y'all think y'all the only people who live in the places that y'all live in? The fuck? This is, this is some Caucasian shit. Like, the girl said she lived there and she just forgot her fault. First of all, if somebody forget they motherfucking thing to open our gate, I just open that motherfucker at this point. Because either I'm going to open it or they going to break in it. So at this point, it don't even fucking matter. Then it's the whole, I'm calling the police for what? Why y'all keep bothering the cops? Y'all do know that's annoying, right? Y'all do know they don't give a fuck, right? Y'all do know it's real crimes being committed, right? Like... You're wasting valuable resources on this bullshit. So it's actual crimes out there being committed and you gonna call the cops because you don't think she lived there and she telling you she lived. Who made you security? Why do you give a fuck? Are you security? If you not security, then the shit don't matter. Go put on a motherfucking uniform over all that ass and then be security and you can decide who the fuck gonna be there, who not gonna be there, check the credentials and all that shit. But until then, get your ass back in that car and go back to the fucking gym or wherever the fuck it is that you finna go work on that goddamn body. Got time for this shit. She's calling the police on me. See, she wasn't. I ain't nobody got time for all this shit. Why you got the flash on? Guys, I forgot my key fob. So is she called the police or what? It's my What? Play wherever you're staying. Wait, so we so can't. Which, which, which townhouse in here are you visiting? What's wrong with that, though? What? I said, what's wrong? Just playing along, around the neighborhood. You know what? How do I know that you okay, are. Okay, hold on, pause, pause. Because I seen this video a couple of times a while back. And I was going to react to it then, but I ended up not doing it. I can't remember why, but, and I think this is why YouTube is age restricting my video. But, um, if you don't take your old ass back in the motherfucking house fucking with these people, leave these little boys alone. And I respect the black boy because he literally, like, he ain't giving her no slack. He ain't giving her no disrespect. He literally, she said, what town home do you live? What the fuck difference it make, bitch? I'm not finna tell you where the fuck I live. That ain't your goddamn business. What is it with these self-made neighborhood watch-ass bitches? If you don't get your old ass back in the goddamn house with them fucking bell-bottom flare too tight in the crotch area ass jeans, go back in the house. Why you fucking with them? Damn! Them, they just trying to play outside. That's all they want to do. They just want to play outside. And here you come. This is the ultimate Karen stamp. This shit here. With the hand on the hip shit. And, and possibly the finger in your face. This shit right here. This hand on your hip shit. Standard just old Karen shit. 
not picking on that kid in this bike. Uh, he, do I know that? What the fuck? Does it matter? Please get back to wherever you're coming from. And you put your phone away. First of all, sh so you, so you gonna assume that the black boy is picking on the white boy because he's black and the other one's white. When they're obviously playing together. The white boy has already said that's not what's happening. You think, do you think for real, if this black boy was taking something from this white boy, he ain't gonna scream, yell, go get his mama, none of that? You think he's just gonna be still with him, hanging out, chilling? The fuck world do you live in? And and whose mama are you? How you gonna tell him put his phone down? He ain't got to do a goddamn thing. He ain't gotta listen to you. The fuck authority do you have other than the one that you created in your motherfucking mind? <laughs> Granny, get your bitch ass back in the house. Get back, get back in the house. Go on back in the house and fucking sit in your recliner and watch whatever the fuck soap opera you was watching and call your grandkids and get on they motherfucking nerves instead of going outside fucking with these kids. We need to think as as a collective county, we don't need to worry about what Richmond has to say. Um, and, and there's a lot of science. There's a lot of good science. You know, the mask protects the person that's wearing it. That's three minutes. Mm -hmm. But you have All right. No mask mandates. My child, my children will not come to school on Monday with a mask on. So she got one or two. All right. That's not happening. And I will bring every single gun loaded and ready to, I, I will call every. Okay, that's three minutes. You, you don't pass your time. It's a policy. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I'll see y'all on Monday. Not. Get all ass neighbors. Um, did she just say is she gonna bring every loaded gun? Like I seen the video before, but see, I still be, it gets me every time. <laughs> like, did she nonchalantly just say I will bring every loaded gun or weapon? to the school before the lady cut her off, what she was trying to say is, I'm gonna bring every fucking gun I got at the crib locked and motherfucking loaded to shoot all you motherfuckers up if my child has to put a fucking mask on. That's what the fuck she said. Ma'am, what you not gonna do is threaten the school. You not gonna threaten the school, the people of the school, the people who run the school, the kids in the school on camera openly that's what you call having a set of balls you just said you was gonna bring every loaded gun over a mask what so you can't just keep your kids at home that's not a that's not an option you can't you don't want your kids to have to change schools and shit like if you can, they can't be homeschooled they can't work remote or go to school remotely or some shit like that because i'm pretty sure they would much rather your kids stay at home and not wear a mask, then you come up in there with guns. Like, what the fuck in your mind? Because she went to jail. Uh, Michelle said she went to jail, which I'm pretty sure she did, because you can't fucking openly threaten a goddamn school and nothing happened to you. I don't give a fuck what skin complexion you are. They probably gonna say she was mentally insane, because you know that's the shit they use for them. But how you just have the audacity to walk in and tell these people that you was going to bring guns to school over a fucking mask. Like, and then you said child, then said children. So you got one kid or two, two or three, one or three. What difference does it make? Take all them bitches out of that fucking school and send them to one that either, I'm taking these out, either they ain't got to wear a mask or it's not mandatory or whatever, but you need to find an alternative solution in bringing guns to the school. I don't, that don't make me feel comfortable. 
And what made me even more uncomfortable is the fact that nobody in the room reacted. All you said was that's 30 minutes time. That's 30 minutes. Okay, she ran out of her time long motherfucking time ago. The minute she said, I'm bringing guns to the school, y'all shouldn't have let her walk out the door. Because now she is a threat to others. Y'all, come on. No, 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 ma'am. No, ma'am. Where you going? You, whoa, whoa, whoa. You can't just say that and then get to walk off and say, see y'all Monday. No, no. You gonna sit your ass right here and wait for these cops to come because you not finna threaten a school to the school board or whoever the fuck it was she was talking to and walk out the door? Like Natalie say, that's the complexion for the protection because it ain't no way in hell that could have been a black person that said this shit. It, could, it couldn't have been. It couldn't have been. Like, everybody in there would have tackled them. They would have called the cops immediately. Something would have happened. Y'all let her walk smooth out the door after she just said she was going to bring guns if y'all do the mask mandate. Guns loaded. It's something wrong with people out here in this world. I, I don't understand it. I don't understand. I just... <laughs> you motherfuckers. <laughs> This shit be funny, like, it makes me mad, but it don't make me, it don't make me as mad as it make Natalie. It make me mad, but then it's still funny, though, like, cause the, the shit that be happening in the world, like, you just really gotta laugh at that shit, like, cause it's, it's like, are you serious right now? Is this really what we doing? Is, is this really what we doing? That was my compilation. I, I can't. I'm done. I will see y'all in the next video. I ain't had no earrings on in this one. My eyes red. I'm tired as fuck. But make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, shout out to Natalie for the TTM promo for our fundraising gala. She will be here on April 9th. And it's going down. We in that thing. So make sure you get your tickets. The link will be in the description. It's a virtual option. So you ain't got no excuses. And if you can't come, you could donate. Hmm? Do that. Let's do that. Let's get that done. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I love y'all. And until the next one, bye.